In today's tutorial, I'm going to be taking you through some tips on how to dress for a cocktail event. Now the great thing about cocktail events is that they allow you to inject personality into the outfit through accessories. However, all cocktail outfits should start with a well-fitted suit. Now a well-fitted suit should come to the widest part of your shoulder without falling over. This ensures that your shoulders look broad without them sloping on the sides. And it also stops you getting a hollow look on the side here in the shoulder. Now with your blazer, you should see roughly a quarter of an inch of your cuff and also allow for accessories such as watches or bracelets. Here today we have an eminence watch with a black strap and silver face. And we've paired that back with another eminence bracelet and one of our Joel Wade silver rings. Now a black wristwatch with a silver face is a must have for every man's wardrobe as it is suitable for work as well as formal occasions. Now, with the cocktail attire, it's also important to have a suitable fitting pant. Now, suitable fitting pants should not be bunchy. They shouldn't be oversized. They should fit nicely on the leg. As you see here, we have a crease front pant. So with a crease front pant, it's important that your pant length sit just on the top of your shoe usually roughly in line with your ankle bone. What this is giving is a solid line all the way up his leg, which is giving him added height visually, but also ensuring that he looks long and proportionate. So to add personality into Ryan's outfit today, we've gone with the Cooper's Brother tie and pocket square. Now the great thing about these is they have a number of different colors, but we've used a tie with a black base to bring that through in this suit. We've also taken the color pink, which you see here in the roses, We've added this as a lapel pin. You don't always need to wear a lapel pin, but similar to a bow tie, a lapel pin is just that added bit of fun and flair to an outfit. This isn't your everyday dressing. So when you've added the finishing touches to your outfit in the form of accessories, as we've just discussed, when considering how to do up your blazer, the easiest rule of thumb is to remember only to do your top button up. What this does is it helps to anchor your outfit. It gives you a V line, so it's broadening your shoulders, but it's also drawing attention to the slimmest part of your figure, so it's showing this waistline here as well. What this will do is it'll help ensure that your body looks proportionate from your shoulders through your waist, and then again down into the leg. Now remember, this isn't a black tie event, it's a cocktail event. So don't be afraid to have fun with color and print like we've done with today's accessories. Now the last thing that you need to bring to the outfit is confidence and that's only something you can do. Thank you for watching and we'll see you next time on Uberman TV.